Tonight on the 10 o'clock news, a public middle school in Duval County is causing fireworks after promoting a bring your Bible to school day. I did think it was weird that they said only the Bibles because there are a lot of other religions. I'm Christian, so I would be okay with it. This designated day is set to take place at a student, a student club at the La Villa School of the Arts tomorrow. And as you heard from those students, some don't mind the day while others are taking offense to it. News for Jacks reporter Renee Beninati spoke with both parents and students. She's joining us live from the school in downtown Jacksonville tonight. Renee? Joy, we talked to a group of parents who feel that by allowing this event, the school is leaving many students out. Some have even gone as far as filing formal complaints with the U.S. Department of Education. They've been talking about it. On Sophia Driscoll is a sixth grade student here at the La Villa School of the Arts. She tells me over the past week or so, the school has been promoting bring your Bible to school day over the intercom. Yeah, they're just like spread faith, you know, and I think it's a nice thing. I don't have a Bible. I know a lot of people who also don't. The school says it's a nationwide student led movement to celebrate religious freedom and encourage faith. They say about like 500,000 kids have done it too. But the idea has sparked a firestorm on social media. Many parents saying the event is not inclusive for children of all faiths. Some parents have even filed discrimination complaints with the U.S. Department of Education's Office for Civil Rights. I do wonder about inclusivity and those kinds of things and well should everybody have their own day or should there you know it's just a matter of having a teacher that represents that faith and so students feel like they belong there other parents support the event i'm okay with it but at the same time we respect what other what people think about news for jacks reached out to duval county public schools the district says the school is not hosting the event it's an activity of a student club at la villa they went on to say quote this is a good example of protected First Amendment student expression. Do you plan on participating in this? Mm, yeah, I'll bring my Bible to school. Raising the question about the separation of schools and religion. The principal of the school here, Leanna Knight, responded to some of those heated comments on Facebook saying that the post was from the club, not the entire school itself. Reporting live in downtown Jacksonville, Renee Beninati, Channel 4, the local station.